Welcome to a time in the shade in Shady Oak Ministries, and now, what's making news? Andy Stanley has announced another sermon series to begin this winter. The title? I don't know what Marcionism means, but I like the sound of it. Burn, heretics! Atheists have put forward the problem of evil as their greatest objection to God's existence. Their argument is, why would a good God allow things they don't like to exist? Like God, for example. You're kidding. You're kidding, right? On September 10, 2023, Muslim migrants assaulted a group of individuals participating in a pride parade in Germany. The delays to relaying this information in Western media seem to be the news agencies trying to figure out who to cheer for. I see nothing. <laughs> Nick Fuentes has appealed to Jesus of Nazareth in support of his nationalistic views. That's right, Jesus, the Jewish Messiah, prophesied by Jewish prophets, born from a Jewish mother, who observed Jewish customs, fulfilled the Jewish law, whose followers were all Jewish. He taught from the Jewish scriptures and offers redemption through the Jewish ceremony of atonement. Is it just me or does this Fuentes character really seem to love the Jews? Yeah, we, we, we don't. <laughs> On August 6, 2023, three terrorists went on a killing spree targeting Israeli civilians. Before they were stopped by the brave men and women of the IDF, or as the BBC tried to report, quote, nothing to see here. Shh. Faithful Mormons seek to model themselves after the life of their prophet, Joseph Smith, in any way they can. However, most try to take exception to that last part where he was shot to death in prison by a mob of men whose daughters he groomed. And now for Time in the Shade's new program, Muslim or Watchtower? where we will read quotes and guess whether it was stated by the Watchtower Bible and Tract Society or a Muslim. This week's quote, Teachings that led to the development of the Trinity began to be officially formulated in 325 Common Era, more than two centuries later, at a council in the city of Nicaea in Asia Minor, now Inzik, Turkey. Was this quote stated by a Muslim or the Watchtower? I'll give you a few more seconds. Leave your answer in the comments. If you guessed Watchtower, you'd be correct. They made this quote in their article, Should You Believe in the Trinity? Trust me. Trust me. And that's the news. Thank you all and good night.